offensive line is going to attack, how the wide receivers are going to come and crack down in the run game. So today should be interesting. Kyle Lowe to kick off. It was Bond to receive in his end zone. Brings it out, finds a crease, and tripped up near the 25-yard line. Play action, takes a shot over the middle, and it is picked off right away. Picked off by Virginia Tech. What a play there. Offensive coordinator Steve Shamko opening the game with play action right here. You know, you found success running the ball. And to the right of Kyron Drones, the transfer from Baylor. Tootin flexes out, and Drones right up the gut. Picks up a nice chunk of change there, a six-yard game. Coaches have said Drones has gotten better every week. Play action on the run, throws it. It is caught there by the tight end. And out to the right, Daquan Wright finds himself a little bit behind that zone defense. And Second down and 10. The handoff to Tootin, avoids a tackler. He's got daylight, turns the corner, lowers the shoulder, and picks up positive yardage on that particular play. And now they are in the red zone on third and short. Drones keeps it and taken down. It looks to be potentially shy of the first down. You go for it. Defense already came and got momentum. And they're going for it. A little brotherly shove, tush push, but flags on the field. As offense, you gotta be able to sit in here. You already captured some momentum. You gotta be able to watch the football. Right tackle right there, Parker Clements. It just leads a little bit too quick. The kick is up and he splits the uprights. Been great at pressuring the quarterback, but not so great at stopping the run. Quick toss out to the boundary to Dino Tomlin. Tomlin picks up a nice chunk of change there. He's a linebacker by trade, but with the injuries at running back, he's in at tailback. Castellanos got time. Now he's going to tuck it and run. He's going to pick up the first down and then some. It takes a hit near midfield. Got a six yard gain. Castellanos dancing, steps up in the pocket. He's going to run again and tripped up near the 40-yard line by Delane. The 39-yard line of Virginia Tech, handoff, and not much there. A loss on the play. Second and 11 from the 40. Broom's got room to run right up the middle. And taken down near the five-yard line. A huge run. Liam Connor's extra point is good. Here's that big run for 38 yards by Broom. And of course, the TD after that. Eight plays, 65 yards to get in the end zone. Hand off again to Broom. Broom right up the gut. He gets in for the touchdown. And the Eagles strike back. A four yard touchdown. Yeah, but half of those are gone today with Jones. A lot of experience there with Jones. Tootin. He will surely be missed some of the, the stresses of this game of football. McGowan in the backfield with him. Gets a block for Castellanos. Plenty of room to run, and Castellanos out of bounds after he picks up the first down. This offense so hard to defend. Pulling big right guard Christian Mahogany, but you also have McGowan, your linebacker, for your quarterback to go get that first down with his legs. Castellanos is going to take a shot down the field. Under throws it again, and this time intercepted. Dorian Strong, his second interception of the game. On Dino Tomlin, and he's able, he's trying to force him to the edge. Castellanos has to be able to get that ball to the sidelines a little bit more, where only Tomlin can make a play. For Virginia Tech, Drones play action on the run. Throws it, caught there by Daquan Wright. He's able to snatch it and picks up the first down as he gets into Eagles territory. Unbelievable window that you just fit that in right there, but a heck of a catch. Drones with the toss to Tootin. He's got a block. It's Wright who blocks for him, and he picks up about six yards. Malachi Thomas in the backfield on third and five. Drones keeps it up the middle. It's going to be short of the first down by about two yards. Drones. Keeps it up the middle, fights for yardage, and picks up the first down. First down for the 33-yard line. Drones keeping it again. And he picks up about six yards as John Pupil trips him up. Virginia Tech 0 for 3 on third downs. Drones. Plenty of room there, and 
tripped up in the red zone near the 15-yard line. Second and six, though, give him four. Drones with the keeper. And he's tackled third and two. Drones, five rushes for 23 yards on this drive. They give it to Tootin, and he walks into the end zone for the touchdown. Virginia Tech capitalizes on the Boston College turnover and takes the lead. Off with a TD by two. Second and eight from the 49 of Boston College. Drones with the run off the left side. First quarter winding down. Drones with the keeper. Turns the corner, picks up the first down, and tackled inside the 35-yard line for a first down. Donovan Ezaraku takes him down after the seven-yard gain, and that will That's be the, the end, end of the first quarter. quarter. Second and seven from the 31. Tootin makes a man miss. Still on his feet and taken down at the 27-yard line by John Pupil. Ball on the 27-yard line. Drones keeps it again. Goes behind Tootin. He's met. Drones, plenty of time. Over the middle, he's got a man. All the way into the end zone, Steven Gosnell for the touchdown. A 22-yard strike. And Drones and Virginia Tech extend their lead. Seconds off the clock. And Drones goes underneath to Gosnell. Thomas Castellanos, two interceptions. And he's going to keep it on the ground this time. Avoids a big hit. Broom with a big run. Drags defenders for a first down, a seven-yard gain. Virginia Tech showing blitz. Castellanos probing. Thought about running, flag on the play. He takes off and will be close to the first down depending on the laundry. Castellanos though, he's exciting. They dump it off to Tomlin. If he makes a man miss, but not enough. He couldn't even get back to the original line of scrimmage. A good run, he is just be coming out the gate swinging. Yeah, they've learned. At least this week they have in drones. Plenty of room to run. He's still on his feet, weaving through traffic and defenders and taken down inside the 20-yard line. Amari Jackson yeah. wrecking crew. Just an unbelievable job. You know, they pulled their, their tackle. Big Xavier Chaplin from the left tackle all the way to the right side. Kyron Jones fakes the pit. Tootin up the middle. Met at the 12-yard line by Vinny De Palma. On the move, drones over 100 yards, 12 carries, 116 yards already. The toss to Tootin. Tootin tries to turn the corner, will get enough. Lane in motion. They find Lane, wide open, walks it into the end zone for the five-yard score. Another touchdown for Virginia Tech. Caps it off with an easy touchdown pass to Lane. Castellanos keeps, gets around the edge, and will be taken down at the 32-yard line. A wide receiver by trade, but because of injury at running back today. They give it to Coleman, turns the corner. To me, fourth and one, and you're in shock, though. Castellanos looks like he's snuck past the marker for a first step. First and ten. And off up the middle to the 40-yard line. After the missed tackle. Castellanos. Nowhere to go on that one. Castellanos will lose two. Excited about Cole Nelson. They've talked about him stepping up. He knifes it. This is a gotta have it play for this Boston College defense. Virginia Tech has completed three of the last four third downs, and he puts it right on the money to Daquan Felton. Felton stays on his feet and spun around and down at the nine-yard line, but a flag on the play. And Virginia Tech, a backbreaker here before the end of the half. They've got a tight end there with him. Tootin up the middle. 
inside the five, trying to keep the legs churning and down to the four-yard line, a five-yard gain. Tootin up the middle for a touchdown! Basil Tootin! Unbelievable job by Tootin reading this thing out and just bringing physicality. Boston College on their own 25, empty backfield. Underneath to Lewis Bond, a short gain of four yards. Coming through for his young quarterback. Castellanos with time in the pocket. Fires one over the middle to his tight end, Franklin, for a first down. Taken down at the 49-yard line. A 20-yard gain, and Boston College in business. 44 seconds left in the first half, and they're going to go. They're putting the foot on the gas. They got a man open. It's Felton with a first down at the 31-yard line. They are not taking a knee. They are going for it. Clock now resets and ticking. Drones with time over the middle. Caught by Lane. Lane bounces off a tackler. Now running down the sidelines and out of bounds near midfield. Another big play there. 18-yard gain. Here comes the blitz. Drones running around dancing and throws it in no man's land. Drones loses the football. The ball is on the ground. And he's able to regain it. Thankfully, he was looking left to throw and didn't get the ball and tuck it in. I want to say a quick apology to all Virginia Tech fans and alumni for calling them the name that they don't like to be called. It won't happen again. But back when I was getting recruited by Virginia Tech, a coach had called it the other name for me. But apologies anyways to that fan base. You know, it's okay. Or near perfection in the first half. Drones on the run to his tight end right, right. Switching his positioning to try to gain more yards as he cuts back inside. The handoff is to Tootin. He bounces off a defender and he breaks it out to the outside. Tripped up in Boston College territory by Amari Jackson. When Tootin continues to run tough and hard, bouncing off tacklers, this Offense has fell. So let's see what they do offensively to try to crawl, crawl themselves out of that hole. We saw a ton of that last week against Louisville. Drones with the keeper. Gets to the outside and taken down at the 39-yard line by Cole Baston. A gain of 12. Drones with the keeper. Pushes forward and should have enough for the first down. John Pupil, since he started in week three. Drones. Rolling to his right on the run to the boundary. It is caught by Aiden Green. It was the worst first down yardage they'd gained in a game since the Old Dominion game. And they push the pile forward for a first down there. Quan Williams with the tackle. That is nearly perfect balance. Drones keeps it again. Breaking tackles and picks up another first down. Doing a great job hiding that football. They are. And we're all the way up here. I can't imagine being on the football field trying to see it. Quick toss to Lane. Lane cuts back. Take it down inside the five. Near the marker again by Jalen Cheek with the tackle. Drones in shotgun. To Tootin up the middle. Keeps the legs churning. And he gets in the end zone. A touchdown. You want to talk about fortitude are in complete control in Chestnut Hill. To move the chains. Virginia Tech showing blitz. They get close. Screen to Barfield. No, check that. To Lewis Bond. Picks up the first down on that play. In the hurry up. Castellanos up the middle. Weaving through traffic. Castellanos over the middle. Caught by Griffin, dragging defenders. And inside the 35-yard line to the 33, a first down. Percent completion percentage on fourth down. Great throw by Castellanos. BC in the hurry up. Castellanos under pressure, avoids a tackler, throws on the run. Throws and it's complete to Jeremiah Franklin, the big tight end with a diving reception. A 17-yard gain. Great job by Castellanos being able to find a seam to climb the pocket and throw the ball down. He's on the left side at number 44, as you mentioned. 
They toss it to Franklin, the tight end, and he's upended near the line of scrimmage, but a flag on the play. Monsoor Delane, the tackler on Franklin. Sometimes when you're in that red area, those windows are tight. Third and 20. Franklin pushed out of bounds for a shot. Castellanos got a man. It's caught. Touchdown. Jaden Skeets, the freshman from Hyde Park, Massachusetts. Here's the touchdown. Castellanos rolling to his right, dumps it off to Bond. He gets the two-point conversion. With the two-point conversion, BC trying to claw their way. They're staying on schedule. One of your earlier points begin the broadcast. The toss to Felton, and he's going to be just shy. Drones keeps it, makes a man miss, and easily picks up the first down. Virginia Tech in control. Malachi Thomas with open field in front of him. An easy touchdown. Dial it up. A house call for Malachi Thomas of 35 yards. The most points for the Hokies since they scored 48 on November 13th, 2021 against Duke. Anyone, because as you know, partner, hand fighting is a big part of this. Yeah, when you're in that offensive line, defensive line world, it's all about the hand fighting. And a screen pass to Dyke. Or excuse me, to Duke. Up with getting them to put the ball in the air right here. The toss oh. to the boundary and shut down after a short gain of about two and a half yards between 40 and 49. The kick is up and it is good. Most points in an ACC road game since November 19, 2005, when they scored 52. At Virginia to end the season. Wells takes off, showing off the wheels. Can he finish the deal? No, the ball pops out into the end zone, and it looks like it'll be a touchback. I want Drones' playbook. We're on the field is a fumble, and the field of play through the end zone results in plays a touchback. Xavier Coleman. Just incredibly athletic. To Castellanos' credit, when we spoke to him earlier this week, oh, and the ball was touched, and Boston College may have recovered. I will finish the Castellanos story in our chat with him. Tucker Holloway calling for the fair catch, and it hit right off his chest. He was trying to one-hop it. To try to catch that ball as clean as possible. Never really want it to bounce because it could bounce in many different directions and maybe possibly bounce off of you as we just saw. Andre Hines. And he was balling crying, Jeff Halfley told us, just of joy. Yeah, red shirt junior, right? I mean, you waited a very long time to get his opportunity. And sometimes that opportunity never comes or people in today's college football, they jump ship, right? To go seek that opportunity out. He was fairly convincing about some of the flaws he still has in his game. But allowing him to be himself, but today coming out and throwing it on the first play might have not been the best thing to do against an aggressive defense that Virginia Tech does play. Check, check, check. They got them all, right? Yes, and that's why you hope it's a stepping stone, right? Here's a toss to the tight end. He gets down near the goal line, down at the one-yard line. Franklin. So nice job by him catching it and running right there. Coleman into the end zone for the touchdown. Took a brutal hit, was taken to the hospital at, in that game in the fourth quarter. And he underwent spinal surgery at the University of Louisville Medical Center on Friday. Oh, we have a loose ball here. Final surgery at the University of Louisville Medical Center on Friday, one day after he was hurt in UVA's game. The school said the surgery was successful. You know, for me, George, I retired about five years ago out of nowhere, and a lot of people were wondering why, and that's because I had my first child. And at that point, for me, yes. There's, there's and, no doubt. And the leagues have been doing a better and better job each and every year. Pop Watson in at quarterback, picks it off of the ground. 
and heads out of bounds. There's a flag on the play. For Virginia Tech, being able to get to your third string quarterback and find success, know that Grant Wells fumbled that last one, but at the same time, anytime you could develop the young players. Baptism under fire there for young Emory Williams. It's no other way, right? I mean, you get your first start, it's Clemson. You gotta go to OT. And then that, it's a night game as well. Whole world watching. Well, big plays on offense, big plays on defense. They played Wake Forest and they were able to get it done as well. This builds confidence for that last game, being able to get a, a road win, right? I think that's going to help this football team, especially knowing that you got that big battle at the end of the season against Virginia. And that'll do it. The two coaches exchanging pleasantries.